starts now with breaking news. First at noon, Sand Springs police released body camera video from an officer involved shooting. They say the victim's family asked them to wait to release the video until after his funeral this past weekend. News on 6's Amy Kaufman joins us now with the latest. Amy. Well, Jonathan, this is the first officer involved shooting that Sand Springs Police Department has worked in nearly four years. And we want to warn you, this video could be disturbing to some of our viewers. Now, in this video, you can see 49 year old Robert DeJarlis Jr. run into a Sand Springs police officer, pinning him between his door and the car. The officer, who was identified as Lieutenant Kevin O'Keefe, commanded DeJarlis to stop four times, but he kept going, nearly running the officer over. The original pursuit started just after eight Sunday night on the first. But when O'Keefe tried to pull DeJarlis over for a traffic stop, he took off, leading O'Keefe on a pursuit for four miles. That's when DeJarlis drove onto a dead end road, then ended up turning around, coming at Lieutenant O'Keefe. O'Keefe commanded him to stop four times, then fired four shots into the vehicle's driver's side window, hitting him four times, killing him at the scene. Now, Lieutenant O'Keefe went to the hospital and was treated for minor injuries and is now on paid administrative leave at this time. But Sand Springs Police Department says OSBI has now taken over this investigation and they will hand their report over to the district attorney's office when it's complete. And we'll have much more on this story coming up tonight on News on 6. Live in 